Now, as you guys following along, I've created this master Google Sheet that helps you create blog posts in bulk using Zimwriter, but I've also been adding other tools such as interlinking and now SEO optimization. And so this one in particular uses Rank Math Pro. So you'll need the Pro account in order to import the final results as a CSV, but I'm gonna walk through how to generate that. But if you do wanna get Rank Math Pro, please click on the link down below. I'll receive a commission. By you doing that, it continues to help support me, help support this channel so I can continue to develop tools that'll be helpful for you. But what you're gonna look at ultimately is in this AI Assistant in this Rank Math SEO tab, it's gonna be completely blank for you. But whenever you do do this, you're gonna to go to AI Assistant, go to Optimize Post for SEO. And so what you're gonna have is you're gonna have two options. This option that I currently have, I just grabbed the post from my website. If you have any in the Articles tab, such as down here, you can go ahead and do that and it'll pull the meta descriptions that get generated by Zimwriter and it'll pull them into this tab and you can choose on the important basics tab. You can choose to uncheck it or check it if you want to optimize a slug, if you want to optimize the meta description, things like that. So that's all going to be in the important basics tab. There's going to be three check boxes for you there, but you also need to make sure that you have the OpenAI API key in that important basics tab. I'll put a link down in the description below on how to get that all set up, how to make sure everything looks good on that end. And you're also gonna need a folder uh, with a folder ID in there set up too, so it knows where it's gonna save that CSV. Again, I'll put a link in the description below on how to find a folder ID. And then, I'm also, and then you'll also need to have your WordPress set up with your admin and your password uh, for the application password that we've generated. So. Make sure you have all of those things set up, uh, but that's what you need for this. In order to pull from the website, it'll do that. But then as it goes, it's going to auto-generate or auto-fix the slugs, the SEO title, the SEO description to be optimized according to Rank Math Pro. And then it might be still lacking on some of the nuances, especially with content, if you're not using the SEO writer with Zimwriter. Highly recommend that, but this is just for the purpose of getting started, just getting started with Zimwriter bulk writer. But what you're going to do is after you're going to do optimize posts for SEO, you'll do the posts for SEO from the website. So go ahead and do that and it'll load like this and it'll look like this. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to do get a CSV for Rank Math Pro. Whenever I do that, it's going to create that CSV in that folder that we have set up on the important basics tab. So go ahead and go to that folder download that CSV. We're going to touch base again at our WordPress site in Rank Math Pro. So here we are. We're in Rank Math Pro. Make sure you have SEO Pro installed. If you don't, you're not going to see the same screens as me. But what we want to do next in this Rank Math tab, we need to go to Advanced Mode. In the Advanced Mode, we're going to see this Import and Export option. Within there, we'll be able to choose the CSV file that we already generated. So mine's going to be way down here and so what, it, what the options you're going to have is you can do not overwrite existing data highly recommend this just want to make sure we're not overwriting the stuff that we already have in if you're if you do know what you're doing you can uncheck this to make sure that it does overwrite the data that you previously didn't like um, but make sure you have all that ironed out before you do that and make sure to back up anything before just in case then you can go ahead and hit import I already did this, so I'm not gonna do it again. Don't want it to waste the video, but hopefully you guys found this quick video very helpful. If you guys have any questions, you need me to go into any more detail, please put a comment in the description below and I'll either make another video or try to answer your questions in the comments.